Kia ora everyone, good to be with you today. Today I am so excited to be able to read you a story called Harry McCleary's Catawall Caper. The author and illustrator of this book is Lindley Dodd. She has done so well with her work, she's become Dame Lindley Dodd a famous New Zealand author of children's books, currently living in Tauranga. With a twitch of his tail and a purposeful paw, down by the river crept Scarface Claw. He woke up a lizard, he startled a bee, and he bothered a blackbird high in a tree. Higher and higher, he sneakily snuck, but up in the branches he suddenly stuck. Reow! He yelled. Harry McCleary was eating his meal, jelly meat, biscuits, a snippet of veal. All of a sudden, he heard a strange sound, a yelling a wailing that echoed around. (coughs) Said Harry McClary, and off he went. Hercules Morse was asleep in a glade, with his tail in the sun and his head in the shade. Then came the sound that echoed around. (coughs) said Hercules Morse, and off he went. Bottomly Potts was rolling about with his feet in the air and his tongue hanging out. Then came the sound that echoed around. (coughs) said Bottomly Potts, and off he went. Muffin McClay was having a bath in the old wooden tub at the side of the path. Then came the sound that echoed around. (coughs) Said Muffin McClay, and off he went. Bitsy Maloney was having a scratch as he lay in the sun in the strawberry patch. Then came the sound that echoed around. (coughs) Said Bitsa Maloney, and off he went. Snitzel von Crumb was digging a hole in his favourite spot by the passion fruit pole. Then came the sound that echoed around. said Snitzel von Crum, and <coughs> off he went. Puffing and panting, impatient to see, together they came to the foot of the tree. They sniffed and they snuffled, they bustled around, and they saw what was making the terrible sound. said Snitzel von Crumb. Bo wo 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 said Bitsa Maloney. Ruh, ruh, said Muffin McClay. Ruh, 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 ruh. said Bottomly Potts. Ruh, said Hercules Morse. Yep, yep, yep. said Harry McCleary. And... <coughs> said Scarface Claw. The din was so awful that uphill and down, you could hear the cacophony all over town. Mrs. Plum brought a ladder and climbed up the tree. She rescued old Scarface. At last, he was free. With a flick of his tail and a shake of each paw, off at a gallop went Scarface Claw.
and back to their business and Donaldson's Dairy went all of the others with Harry McCleary. You can enjoy more stories about Harry McCleary and all his friends if you head to our school library, have a look in the picture book section under D for Dodd, Dame Lindley Dodd. What a great story that was. I hope you enjoyed it a lot. I certainly enjoyed reading it to you. <laughs>